You know what? I wouldn't want that Grandpa Chad smoke either. But we do find a okay lobby. There are a bunch of low S players, including myself, currently in S3. Obviously, Grandpa Chad is way better than S3, but it's where the game put us. We're going to slowly work our way up to infinite rank over the next however many months it takes, or weeks, or day. You never know. Nice shot. I mean, I'm not going to get infinite rank in one day. Especially with shots like that. But there is one player who I think went from S6 into infinite rank in one stream. If you've never watched Ricardo play, guy's pretty crazy. You should check him out. Yeah, this is actually kind of interesting because if I can make the shot, I can still save par. I still can probably save par. I was close to the chip and birdie there. But 14 feet away, to save par after getting in a fairway bunker is not too bad. Bruh. Alright, all I have done here is set myself up for an incredible comeback. Five points down. It's nothing to be afraid of. Five point comeback can definitely happen over four holes. It'll make the game way more entertaining. And it's what I'm going to do here today. Go from tied for last into first place by the end of the game. Mark my words. That's what's going down. Fear not everyone. Grandpa Chad will pull through. Unless I end up in 6th, which would be funny because on this account I've never gotten like 4th, 5th, 7th, or 8th. I've never placed in any of those positions in a game, but I have placed 6th like 2 times I think. So it would be kind of ironic if I got 6th again, but let's just like not do that, let's get 1st instead. Yeah, this is not the easiest putt to read at all. I'm pretty sure we're slanted to the right, even though it kind of looks flat. But how much, I'm not sure. I gotta make a decision though, and this is what I will go for. All right, well, we are in it. We are six points down, but we are in it nonetheless. As long as we're in the game, we are in it to win it. Three holes left, starting on hole seven. Seven is not the easiest hole, and the next hole is not gonna be the easiest either. So if I can clutch up here, secure birdie here, birdie next hole, we will be making up points no matter what. I'm sure of it, but I really gotta clutch up here on a tough hole seven with tough wind. All right, that's good. Nicely on the fairway with a clear shot onto the green, no trees in the way. And I think just a bit under full power on the three. Oh my, I did not mean to do that. That was bad. So if I can clutch up here, secure, birdie here. Ooh. 
Hey, listen, we're not out of it yet. We are not out of it yet. Eight points down, that's fine. We got hole eight here. Just gotta get the hole in one, get myself into the finals, and then figure it out from there. Exactly. It is a beautiful hole in one there on hole eight with tricky wind. Exactly what I needed to get myself back in the game. Right now I'm eight points down. Now I am tied for first. Look at that. On to hole 11 here. I don't really know what to say other than Grandpa Chad is living up to his name, that's for sure. I think this is a full send seven iron moment with backspin. Nice shot. Yeah, that's exactly what that was. Nice one. 16 feet away, gotta sink this putt to make sure I can either win or get to a closest to the pin. Yeah, so with that, I think we're gonna be going to a closest to the pin. Put a nice birdie there on hole 11, and never mind. With that birdie, that will put me in first place. That will be a win, a clutch one point victory. Cheeky emote there. What a game, what a game. The top end of S3, we're gonna rank up right now. Started off with a bogey. Told you guys that was my plan all along to set myself up for a great comeback. Hole seven, not gonna talk about that. And then hole eight, obviously. Great hole in one. And just, yeah, overall, good game. Well, folks, that is a banger way to finish off the video. If you enjoyed, hit the like button. And if you want to see more content, hit the subscribe button, and I will see you guys in the next video.